Sid Caris, a classically trained ballet dancer, was known for her exceptional ability to adapt to various dance styles and partner with famous co-stars like Gene Kelly and Fred Astaire. She graced the screens with her glamour and sensuality in popular musicals such as Singing in the Rain, Brigadoon, and The Bandwagon, earning her a place as one of the most luminous stars in old Hollywood musicals. Today, her legacy continues to shine, inspiring new generations of dancers and film enthusiasts. Delve into this classic and experience the magic of Sid Caris's unforgettable performances. Sid Caris, often regarded as the greatest female movie dancer, was known for her remarkable ability to partner with both Fred Astaire and Jean Kelly. Her only real rival was Elena Powell, a prodigious hoofer from the world of tap dancing. Caris's career as a dancer and actress spanned over five decades, and she became a symbol of glamour and elegance in Hollywood. She was born Shula Ellis Finklia on March 8, 1922, in Amarillo, Texas, and started taking dance lessons at a young age. Carissa's natural talent and dedication led her to join the ballet Russ de Monte Carlo, where she performed for several years before transitioning to film. Her first film appearance was in the 1943 musical Something to Shout About, where she danced in a small role. However, it was her partnership with Fred Astaire in the 1953 film, The Bandwagon, that catapulted Charisse to stardom. Their chemistry on screen was undeniable, and Carissa's long legs and graceful movements became a highlight of the film. Sherry's also had a successful partnership with Gene Kelly, most notably in the 1952 film Singing in the Rain. Their dance routine in the Broadway melody sequence is considered one of the greatest movie dance numbers of all time. Despite Carissa's success, she faced competition from Elena Powell, a talented tap dancer who was also making a name for herself in Hollywood. Powell's energetic and dynamic style contrasted with Carissa's elegant and graceful movements, making them rivals in the world of movie dancing. However, Carissa's talent and versatility allowed her to stand out, and she continued to have a successful career in film and television. She passed away on June 17, 2008, but her legacy as a legendary movie dancer lives on. In summary, Sid Charisse was a trailblazing dancer, an actress who left an indelible mark on Hollywood. Her partnerships with Fred Astaire and Gene Kelly are still celebrated today, and her rivalry with Elena Powell only added to her legacy as a movie dancing icon. Sid Caris, a trained ballet dancer, found her true calling in jazz and modern dance styles. Although she began her career with the ballet Russ, Carissa's dynamic and alluring talent led her to excel in a different direction. It was Fred Astaire who famously referred to her as beautiful dynamite, capturing her explosive and captivating presence on screen. Carissa's work with Gene Kelly in Singin' in the Rain and with Fred Astaire in the bandwagon solidified her status as a legendary performer. In Singin' in the Rain, she and Kelly performed the iconic dance number Broadway Melody, which has become one of the most memorable scenes in film history. Carissa's grace and precision, combined with her undeniable chemistry with Kelly, made for an unforgettable performance. In the bandwagon, Sherry Zantz again proved her versatility as a dancer, this time with Fred Astaire. The two shared a remarkable chemistry, and their performances together were nothing short of magical. Astaire himself was known for his exceptional dancing skills, and his praise for Sherry speaks volumes about her talent. Carissa's contributions to the world of film and dance are still celebrated today. Her ability to seamlessly blend ballet technique with jazz and modern styles made her a standout performer in a time when dance on screen was becoming increasingly popular. Her legacy continues to resonate with audiences, and her performances in these classic films remain some of the most memorable in Hollywood history. Sid Caris, born Chula Ellis Finklia in Amarillo, Texas in 1921, developed an interest in dance at a young age. After contracting polio at six years old, she turned to dance as a form of therapy, unknowingly setting the stage for her future career. Carissa's natural talent and dedication to dance led her to excel in both ballet and modern styles. Her versatility as a dancer became her signature, earning her recognition alongside other Hollywood dancing stars such as Eleanor Powell, Ann Miller, and Vera Ellen. Throughout her career, Cherise graced the screens of various notable films and shows demonstrating her impressive range and technique. Audiences were captivated by her performances, which showcased her unique ability to seamlessly blend both ballet and modern dance styles. Carissa's early life 
and training laid the foundation for her successful career in Hollywood. Her passion for dance and unwavering dedication to her craft allowed her to leave a lasting impact on the industry and continue to inspire future generations of dancers and performers. Indeed, Carissa's legacy as a Hollywood icon and versatile dancer remains etched in the annals of film history, serving as a testament to her undeniable talent and enduring influence. Even today, her classic performances continue to captivate audiences and inspire aspiring dancers around the world. Sid Caris, a name synonymous with grace and beauty, adopted her first name from her brother's mispronunciation of sister. She later added Sharisto her stage name, taking it from her first husband, Nico. Long before she became a household name, Sid began her career as a dancer, joining the prestigious Ballet Russe de Monte Carlo. Throughout her time with the Ballet Russe, Sid worked with some of the most notable choreographers of her era. Her natural talent and captivating stage presence quickly set her apart from her peers. It wasn't long before Hollywood came calling and Sid found herself transitioning from the ballet stage to the silver screen. In 1939, Sid married Nico Caris and the couple remained together until his passing in 1990. Their love story, much like Sid's career, was filled with grace, beauty, and a touch of old world glamour. Sid's transition to film was seamless as she brought her years of dance experience and natural charisma to the big screen. Audiences couldn't get enough of this classic Hollywood star, who continued to dazzle them with her performances for decades to come. Throughout her career, Sid worked with some of the most iconic directors, actors, and choreographers in the business. From her early days at the Ballet Rust to her final film appearances, Sid Sherry's left an indelible mark on the world of entertainment. Her impact can still be felt today, as modern day dancers and actors continue to be inspired by her work. Sid Carissa's legacy is one that will endure for generations to come, a testament to her undeniable talent and enduring charm. As we look back on the life and career of this remarkable woman, we can't help but be captivated by her story. From her humble beginnings to her rise to stardom, Sid Carissa's journey is one that continues to resonate with audiences today. And while she may no longer be with us, her legacy lives on, immortalized on the silver screen for all to enjoy. In the end, Sid Carissa's life and career serve as a reminder of the power of perseverance, hard work, and natural talent. Through her many film appearances, she brought joy and inspiration to countless audiences, leaving behind a legacy that will continue to captivate and delight for generations to come. Sid Carissa, originally known as Chula Ellis Finklia, made her film debut in the 1943 movie Something to Shout About, where she performed a ballet under the name Lily Norwood. Carissa's natural talent and passion for dance caught the eye of a choreographer who recognized her potential and brought her to the attention of MGM Studios. It wasn't long before Carissa's career took off, and she quickly became MGM's principal ballet dancer. Her elegant and graceful movements, combined with her undeniable charisma, made her a standout in the world of movie musicals. Carissa's most memorable roles came alongside some of Hollywood's most iconic leading men, including Fred Astaire and Gene Kelly. In the 1946 film Ziegfeld Follies, she resistance with Astaire in a now classic routine that showcased her incredible skill and stage presence. She also starred alongside Kelly in the 1952 film Singin' in the Rain, where she delivered a stunning performance in the film's dream ballet sequence. Throughout her career, Cherise appeared in numerous other movie musicals, including The Bandwagon, Silk Stocking, and Brigadoon. Her contributions to the genre helped to solidify her place as a true Hollywood legend, and her performances continue to be celebrated and cherished by audiences today. Despite the many challenges she faced as a woman in the male-dominated world of Hollywood, Cherise persevered and became one of the most accomplished and respected dancers of her time. Her impact on the world of movie musicals cannot be overstated, and her legacy continues to resonate with audiences to this day. Sid Caris, a renowned actress and dancer, received high praise from her contemporary, Fred Astaire, who considered her one of the greatest dancers of her day. MGM recognized her talent and signed her to a seven-year contract, even insuring her legs for $5 million due to their importance in her performances. Although the actress had a distinctive accent, she received voice lessons at MGM to enhance her singing skills. However, her songs were always dubbed in her films due to her accent. Despite this, Carissa's dancing skills 
An on-screen presence made her a beloved figure in classic Hollywood films. Carissa's accent did not hinder her acting career, as she appeared in numerous films and shows, often alongside some of the biggest stars of the time. Her unique style and undeniable talent made her a standout in any production she was a part of. The actress's training and dedication to her craft were evident in every performance, and her contributions to the world of film and dance continue to be celebrated and appreciated to this day. Her legacy as a classic Hollywood star and talented dancer remains strong, inspiring future generations to pursue their passions and perfect their craft. Sid Caris, known for her exotic roles in Hollywood films, often found herself cast alongside actors with ethnic backgrounds, such as Ricardo Montalban. This was largely due to her striking dark hair and eyes, which set her apart from many of her contemporaries. One of the most notable aspects of Carissa's personal life was her romantic relationships with high-profile figures. She dated Howard Hughes Jr., the wealthy business magnate and filmmaker, before eventually marrying Tony Martin, a popular singer and actor, in 1948. This union came after Sherajad divorced her first husband, Nico Caris. Despite her success in the film industry, Carissa's personal life remained a subject of interest for many of her fans. Her relationships with Hughes and Martin, in particular, were widely covered in the press and helped to solidify her status as a Hollywood icon. Throughout her career, Carissa's exotic looks and undeniable talent earned her a place in the hearts of audiences around the world. Her contributions to the world of film continue to be celebrated and her legacy lies on through her classic roles and enduring performances. Whether on screen or off, Sherry's left an indelible mark on the entertainment industry and will always be remembered for her captivating presence and undeniable charm. Sid Caris, a talented actress and dancer, experienced both setbacks and triumphs throughout her career. An injury once caused her to lose a role in the film Easter Parade, but this did not stop her from continuing to perform in notable films. One of her most famous roles was in the film Singing in the Rain. In this classic, she captivated audiences with her graceful movements during the Broadway Melody Ballet sequence. This performance is still remembered and celebrated today. Despite facing injuries and setbacks, Cherise remained dedicated to her craft. She found a sense of wonder in the world of film, comparing the strict world of ballet to the fairyland of MGM Studio. Carissa's time at MGM Studio allowed her to showcase her talents and leave a lasting impact on the film industry. She will always be remembered for her contributions to this classic art form. Throughout her career, Cherise faced challenges and overcame them with determination and grace. Her legacy continues to resonate with audiences today, inspiring new generations of dancers and actresses. Sid Caris, a renowned actress and dancer, overcame her shyness with the help of her co-star and mentor, Jean Kelly. Kelly encouraged her to embrace her unique style and flaunt her elegance, which eventually led to her iconic status in Hollywood. Caris's most important movies include Singin' in the Rain, and the bandwagon, both of which featured unforgettable dance scenes that showcased her extraordinary talent and grace. In Singing in the Rain, she danced alongside Kelly in the iconic Broadway melody number, which is still considered one of the greatest dance sequences in film history. In the bandwagon, Sherry starred alongside Fred Astaire, and their chemistry was undeniable. Their dance routine to the song Dancing in the Dark is a classic that has been celebrated for generations. Carissa's unique style, grace, and athleticism were on full display in this film, and she quickly became one of the most sought-after dancers in Hollywood. Despite her success, Sherry experienced a tragic loss in her personal life. Her daughter-in-law, Sheila Carissa, died in a plane crash in 1979. The loss was devastating for Carissa, but she continued to work in film and on stage, always remembering the joy that dance brought to her life. Carissa's legacy as a dancer an actress continues to inspire generations of performers. Her unique style and grace were unmatched, and her contributions to the world of entertainment will never be forgotten. Even today, her iconic dance scenes in Singing in the Rain and the Bandwagon continue to captivate audiences and serve as a testament to her extraordinary talent. After the decline of Hollywood musicals, Sid Sherry's continued to act in various film and shows. One notable appearance was in Janet Jackson's video for All Right in the 1990s, where she showcased her timeless elegance and grace. In addition to her acting career, the actress also recognized the importance of maintaining physical fitness 
especially for senior citizens. As a result, she produced an exercise video called Easy Energy Shape Up, which provided low-impact workouts tailored for older adults. This endeavor showcased her commitment to promoting health and well-being for people of all ages. Throughout her career, Sid Carissa's contributions to the world of entertainment were recognized and honored. In 2006, she received the National Medal of Arts and Humanities, a prestigious award that acknowledged her lifelong dedication to the arts and her significant impact on American culture. This accolade served as a testament to her enduring legacy and the captivating charm she brought to the silver screen. Indeed, Sid Carissa's impact on the entertainment industry resonated far beyond the golden age of Hollywood musicals. Her ability to adapt to new roles and mediums, as well as her dedication to promoting health and well-being, made her a beloved figure in the world of entertainment. Her contributions continue to be cherished by fans and industry professionals alike, serving as a reminder of the power of perseverance and the enduring allure of classic Hollywood. Featured in various documentaries celebrating MGM's heyday, the actress is well known for her contributions to the film industry. In 1992, she performed as an aging ballerina on Broadway in the classic show Grand Hotel. Sadly, the actress passed away on June 17, 2008, from a heart attack. Despite her talent and success, she was known for her humility and introverted nature, never considering herself a great star. Sid Caress, remembered as one of America's greats in Hollywood musicals, emulated by young performers, left an indelible mark on the industry with her enchanting presence and captivating dance moves. Born Chula Ellis Finklia on March 8, 1922, in Amarillo, Texas, she began her journey in the world of dance at a young age. Trained in classical ballet, Cherry studied under well-known dance instructors, including Bronislava Nijinska, and performed with the ballet Rus di Monte Carlo before transitioning to film. Her first film appearance was in the 1943 musical Something to Shout About, where she danced under the name Lily Norwood. Carissa's breakthrough role came in 1952 when she starred alongside Gene Kelly in Singing in the Rain, one of the most celebrated musicals in Hollywood history. Her performance in the film's Broadway melody number, where she danced in a stunning black gown, solidified her status as a leading lady in the genre. Throughout her career, Cherise appeared in numerous classic films, including The Bandwagon, Silk Stockings, and Brigadoon. She worked with some of the most renowned directors and choreographers of the time, including Vincent Minnelli, Stanley Donen, and Fred Astaire. Carissa's unique style and grace on the dance floor made her a standout in the industry. Her ability to seamlessly blend technical skill with emotional expression made her performances unforgettable. Young performers continue to emulate her style and technique, inspired by her legacy. In addition to her work in film, Cherise also appeared on stage and television. She made her Broadway debut in 1976 in The Magic Show and later appeared in the television series Murder, she wrote, and Dancing with the Stars. Carissa's impact on the world of dance and film transcended her time, leaving a lasting legacy that continues to inspire and captivate audiences today. Her life and career serve as a testament to the power of perseverance, passion, and dedication to one's craft. As we reflect on the life and career of this classic Hollywood star, we are reminded of the enduring impact of her artistry. Sid Carissa's legacy continues to resonate with audiences, inspiring new generations of performers to step into the world of dance and film. In the glittering world of Hollywood, Sid Sherry's became a symbol of grace and elegance. Born Chilla Ellis Finklia on March 8, 1922, in Amarillo, Texas, she would eventually captivate audiences with her extraordinary dance skills and magnetic screen presence. Raised in a family that valued the arts, Cherise began her training in ballet at a young age. Her natural talent and dedication led her to perform with the ballet Rust de Monte Carlo, where she honed her craft and dazzled audiences with her technique. In the 1940s, Cherise transitioned to film, quickly becoming one of MGM's most sought-after dancers. She starred in numerous classic musicals, including Singing in the Rain, The Bandwagon, and Silk Stockings. Her on-screen partnerships with stars like Fred Astaire and Gene Kelly became the stuff of legend, showcasing her remarkable versatility and artistry. Throughout her career, Sherry's captivated audiences with her unique blend of strength, grace, and beauty. She became a symbol of the golden age of Hollywood, leaving an indelible mark on the world of entertainment. Carissa's impact extended beyond the silver screen. 
She was a trailblazer for women in dance and film, inspiring generations of performers to pursue their passions and break new ground. Her legacy continues to resonate today, a testament to her enduring talent and grace. From an early age, Sid Sherry showed a natural talent for dance. Growing up in Texas, she was inspired by her ballet teacher to pursue a career in dance. Her family recognized her potential and supported her passion for performing arts. As a young dancer, she was mentored by Nico Caris, who later became her husband and encouraged her to pursue opportunities in Hollywood. Through dedication and hard work, Sid Sherry established herself as a prominent figure in the world of dance and film, captivating audiences with her grace and talent. Born Chala Ellis Finklia, the actress who would become Sid Sherry's was drawn to dance from a young age. At just six years old, she started taking dance lessons and by age 12, she had already decided to pursue a career in ballet. Carissa's passion for dance was fueled by her natural talent and the encouragement of her instructors. She trained at the Ballet Rist de Monte Carlo, where she was eventually promoted to the rank of soloist. However, a series of injuries forced her to reconsider her career path. It was then that Sherry's turned to Hollywood, where she found success as a dancer and actress. She appeared in numerous films, including Singin' in the Rain and The Bandwagon, and became known for her long legs, striking beauty, and incredible dance skills. Despite her success in Hollywood, Sherry's never forgot her roots in ballet. She continued to study and perform dance throughout her life, and even opened her own dance studio in Los Angeles. For Caris, dance was more than just a career, it was a passion that she carried with her always. As she once said, dancing is the only thing I've ever wanted to do. And through her many performances and appearances, she was able to share that passion with audiences around the world. Sid Caris, born Chala Ellis Finklia, faced significant challenges on her path to becoming a renowned actress and dancer. Despite a natural talent for ballet, Carissa's family struggled financially, making it difficult for her to pursue her passion. However, she remained determined and found creative solutions to overcome these obstacles. At a young age, Cherise received a scholarship to study ballet in Los Angeles, but her family could not afford the cost of living there. Undeterred, she worked as a dance extra in movies to make ends meet. This early experience in the film industry sparked her interest in acting and dancing on the big screen. Later, when Sherry's began her career as a dancer in Hollywood, she encountered skepticism from industry professionals who doubted her ability to transition from ballet to film. Ignoring the naysayers, Sherry's and her acting skills and proved her doubters wrong, eventually becoming one of the most sought after dancers and actresses in Hollywood. Carissa's resilience and determination in the face of adversity serve as an inspiration to aspiring performers. Her ability to adapt and find creative solutions to the challenges she faced early on in her career ultimately led to her success in the entertainment industry. Sid Caris, born Chile Ellis Finklia, was a talented dancer and actress who made a significant impact in Hollywood. One of her breakthrough moments came in 1952 with the release of the film Singin' in the Rain. Carissa's performance in the iconic Broadway melody sequence, where she danced with co-star Gene Kelly, received widespread critical acclaim and solidified her status as a leading lady. Carissa's grace, athleticism, and chemistry with Kelly were praised by both peers and critics. The sequence, which featured elaborate choreography and stunning visuals, became one of the most memorable moments in the history of movie musicals. Another breakthrough moment for Sherry's was her performance in the 1953 film The Bandwagon. In this film, she starred alongside Fred Astaire and once again showcased her exceptional dancing skills. The film's dance numbers, including Dancing in the Dark and The Girl Hunt, were met with critical acclaim and are still considered some of the greatest in movie history. Carissa's collaborators often spoke highly of her talent and work ethic. Astaire, who was known for being particular about his dance partners, said of Caris, she's a wonderful dancer. She's very light on her feet, very quick and bright. In addition to her work in film, Sherry's also made a name for herself on the stage. In 1966, she starred in the Broadway production of Sweet Charity, which earned her a Tony Award nomination for Best Actress in a Musical. Throughout her career, Caris's impact on the world of dance and film was undeniable. Her groundbreaking performances and collaborations with some of the greatest talents in Hollywood helped to shape the movie musical genre and solidify her place as a true Hollywood legend. 
Sid Caris, born Chala Ellis Finklia on March 8, 1922 was a renowned American dancer and actress known for her unique style and captivating performances. Carissa's artistic vision and process were deeply rooted in her passion for dance, which she brought to every role she played. From an early age, Cherise was drawn to the world of dance. She trained extensively in ballet, tap, and jazz, and by the time she was a teenager, she had already performed with the ballet Rust de Monte Carlo. This early training shaped Carissa's approach to acting as she often incorporated dance into her performances, creating a unique style that blended storytelling with movement. Carissa's personal experiences and worldview were also reflected in her work. She was known for her strong, independent characters who were often depicted as confident and self-assured. This was likely a reflection of Carissa's own strength and determination as she had to overcome many obstacles in her own life including a childhood illness that left her with a limp, which she worked hard to overcome through dance. One of the most notable aspects of Carissa's style was her ability to convey complex emotions through dance. She was a master of using movement to express feelings and ideas, and her performances were often deeply emotional and moving. This was evident in her work with legendary choreographer and director Bob Foss in the film Sweet Charity, where she played a downtrodden dance hall hostess who finds hope and redemption through dance. Carissa's work also transcended the boundaries of film and dance as she was a trailblazer for women in the entertainment industry. She was one of the first actresses to demand equal pay and creative control over her roles, paving the way for future generations of women in the industry. In conclusion, Sid Carissa's artistic vision and process were deeply rooted in her passion for dance and her desire to tell stories through movement. Her unique style and approach to acting, as well as her personal experiences and worldview, were reflected in her work, making her a true icon in the world of entertainment. Sid Caris, an accomplished dancer and actress, left an indelible mark on Hollywood's golden age. Born Chula Ellis Finklia on March 8, 1922, in Amarillo, Texas, she studied ballet from a young age and eventually joined the Ballet Russe de Monte Carlo. Carissa's transition to film came in the 1940s, where she first appeared in small roles before gaining recognition for her work in Singing in the Rain and the Bandwagon. Her unique blend of ballet and contemporary dance styles, combined with her striking screen presence, made her a standout performer. Mick Lazal, film critic for the San Francisco Chronicle, noted Sid Sherage had a combination of grace and power that was unique. She was both elegant and strong, and that came across in her dancing. Carissa's influence extended beyond her on-screen performances. Her work helped elevate the status of dance within Hollywood musicals, with her routines often serving as the emotional and narrative high points of the films in which she appeared. Michael Phillips, film critic for the Chicago Tribune, commented, Sid Carissa's impact on Hollywood musicals cannot be overstated. She brought a level of artistry and emotional depth to her performances that was truly remarkable. Moreover, Carissa's influence can be seen in the work of contemporary dancers and choreographers. Her ability to seamlessly blend different dance styles, combined with her commanding stage presence, has inspired generations of performers. Dancer and choreographer Susan Stroman noted, Sid Cherries was a trailblazer in so many ways. Her ability to move between different dance styles with such grace and power was truly inspiring. In conclusion, Sid Carissa's contributions to the film and dance industries continue to resonate today. Her unique style and commanding presence helped elevate the status of dance within Hollywood musicals and inspired countless performers. As Stroman put it, Sid Caris's legacy is one that will endure for generations to come. Sid Caris, the renowned actress and dancer, led a life that was as fascinating outside of her professional sphere as it was on screen. She was a devoted wife and mother, and her family always came first. Cherise was married to singer Tony Martin for over 60 years, and they had a son together. Tony Martin Jr. Cherise was also known for her love of animals and had a menagerie of pets, including dogs, cats, and birds. She was passionate about animal rights and worked with various organizations to promote animal welfare. In addition to her love of animals, Cherise was also involved in several philanthropic efforts throughout her life. She was a supporter of the Motion Picture and Television Fund which provides financial assistance and healthcare services to members of the entertainment industry. 
Sherry's also worked with the American Cancer Society and the Arthritis Foundation, using her platform to raise awareness and funds for these important causes. Carissa's personal values and interests often inform her work as an actress and dancer. She was known for her grace, elegance, and athleticism, and her dedication to her craft was unparalleled. Sherry's believed in the power of hard work and discipline, and she spent countless hours practicing and perfecting her craft. Carissa's love of dance began at a young age, and she trained extensively in ballet, tap, and jazz. She eventually became a member of the Ballet Russ de Monte Carlo, where she honed her skills and developed her unique style. Carissa's passion for dance was evident in every performance, and she inspired generations of dancers and performers. Despite her success, Cherie's remained humble and down-to-earth. She was known for her kindness and generosity, and she always took the time to connect with her fan and supporters. Carissa's legacy continues to inspire and captivate audiences around the world, and her impact on the entertainment industry is immeasurable. Sid Carissa, a legendary actress and dancer, left an indelible mark on the film industry. Her grace, athleticism, and expressive dancing made her a standout in classic Hollywood musicals. Carissa's performances in films like Singing in the Rain and The Bandwagon continue to captivate audiences today. For those aspiring to follow in her footsteps, Sherry's offered valuable advice, always be true to yourself and your art. Never stop learning and growing as an artist. Surround yourself with people who inspire and challenge you. And most importantly, never give up on your dreams. Carissa's own career was a testament to the power of perseverance. She began her training as a dancer at a young age and eventually became a soloist with the ballet Russ de Monte Carlo. After transitioning to film, she faced challenges as a woman in a male-dominated industry, but she persisted and became a beloved figure in Hollywood. Looking to the future, Carissa's legacy continues to inspire new generations of artists. The art of dance and storytelling through movement remains a vital part of the entertainment industry. As technology advances and new mediums emerge, there are endless possibilities for how dance can be incorporated into film, television, and digital media. For those looking to contribute to this ever-evolving industry, Carissa's advice remains relevant. Staying true to oneself and one's art, continuously learning and growing, and surrounding oneself with supportive and inspiring individuals are key to a successful and fulfilling career. In the world of entertainment, there will always be a need for talented and passionate artists. By following in the footsteps of legends like Sid Sherry's and continuing to push the boundaries of what is possible, aspiring professionals can make their own mark on the industry and leave a lasting legacy for future generations. Sid Caris, born Chilla Ellis Vinclia, was a classically trained dancer who found her calling in Hollywood. She possessed an unparalleled passion for dance, which was evident in her exceptional performances. Carissa's innovative approach to dance and acting transformed the entertainment industry, leaving an indelible mark that continues to resonate today. Throughout her career, Sherry's captivated audiences with her graceful movements and emotive expressions. She starred in numerous classic films, including Singing in the Rain and The Band Wagon, where she showcased her unique ability to blend storytelling with dance. Carissa's dedication to her craft and her relentless pursuit of perfection etched her name in the annals of Hollywood history. Carissa's impact transcended the world of entertainment. She became a symbol of perseverance and creativity, inspiring generations of artists to pursue their dreams with unwavering determination. Her innovative approach to dance and acting challenged conventional norms, paving the way for future generations of performers to push boundaries and redefine what it means to be an artist. And picture this, Carissa's legacy is not just about the roles she played or the dances she performed. It's about the power of creativity and the importance of pursuing one's passion with unwavering dedication. Her journey serves as a reminder that with hard work and perseverance, anyone can leave an enduring mark on the world. So step in, embrace your creativity, and let your passion guide you towards greatness. Without a doubt, Sid Sherry's left an indelible mark on the world of entertainment. Her work in films like Singing in the Rain and The Bandwagon showcased her incredible dancing skills and captivating screen presence. Carissa's ability to seamlessly blend grace, strength, and emotion in her performances made her a true standout. She was more than just a dancer, though Sherry has also proved herself to be a talented actress, holding her own against some of Hollywood's biggest stars. 
As we reflect on Carissa's career, it's impossible not to be struck by the enduring impact she had on the industry. Her legacy continues to resonate with audiences today, and her work remains a testament to the power of creativity and artistic expression. So, what do you think about Sid Carissa's contributions to the world of entertainment? Do you have a favorite performance or film of hers? We'd love to hear your thoughts in the comments below. And if you enjoy this content, please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more celebrations of the creative spirits shaping entertainment. Together, let's continue to honor the legacies of artists like Sid Sherry's and the many others who have left their mark on the industry.